So we're here with the Think Academy. Hi. Hi, hi. And who are you? <laughs> My name is Brian and I'm in charge of marketing of Think Academy hardware business. And this is a very special uh, educational tablet and you have like uh, a mirror here, yeah. magnetic attached. And then the kids can do a bunch of uh, like education. Yeah, right. So this is like a, a very integrated solution brought to the US market with the hardware and also the software and also functions driven by AI inside it. We can see different like uh, content in math, in reading, in writing, etc. And also this kind of mirror can recognize everything in front of it on table, on paper, including the math problems calculation, reading, and giving the writing prompts to in real time to give within seconds to give like answers and a step by step like explanations of it. Yeah. So now I point with my finger on the happy and then uh, it's using kind of like ChatGPT or some AI uh, solution to, to help the child learn anything they want about anything. Correct. Yes, we use this kind of uh, large grid language model to give this kind of real time explanation which is a uh, very smooth list to the kids. So to motivate the kids to have very efficient learning in home. Because uh, if you integrate AI in the correct way with education, the possibilities are nearly endless for every child to learn so much in the future, right? Yes. And to have customized school. Yeah. We do, you mean school market, right? So we do think about like a school market in the US, we are, thinking of working with the partners to help us to penetrate the schools in the US because you know there is a, like a learning loss uh, through the, the past few years. We want to help the teachers and also the schools to improve the learning efficiency in school and help the kids to have the more and also better learning outcome. Because uh, what I really want to see is a child really enjoy learning and also getting a customized teacher. Yeah. And whatever interest the child has, we'll learn more about it. Yeah. And we'll learn at this level that's correct for every child. Of course, we have this kind of personalized like, content system that which is, which is very adaptive. The kids and child can get into his or her level, which is uh, just a uh, cater to his or her capability. There is like an impossible triangle always saying like a quality, the scale, and also the uh, individualization of the education. With a large language model, we can make this kind of triangle possible, meaning that we can fulfill like a large scale bespoke education for kids with high quality. So uh, there's like a vision system. It's trying to understand kind of what I'm pointing at with my finger. And there is a thinky in there. Is this the thinky? Yeah, this is like our mascot for the thinky, which is like the uh, avatar embedded in the tablet. Thinky is like a AI companion integrated into the tablet that can have the verbal communication with the kids in real time. That can be a teacher, a mot motivator, a mentor, etc., a friend. And here at the, at the show here at CES, you're launching uh, in the US, US market? Yeah, today we are, we just did a launch event and we are launching this brand new SKU in the US market named the ThinkPel AI tablet. And also this tablet is a little bit different from our normal tablet, but it's just a design for the US kids. You can see the, like the size and also the functions are similar to that one, but we make this content Customer for the US, like the uh, age, age 4 to 12 grade, uh, age group, and also you can see this kind of camera, the same can recognize all the content. Yeah. And then you, you can put any book in front of it? Yeah, we can put any workbook and calculation. Uh, for example, with like in the reading process, if you finger point to each single word, you can give the real time explanation and help the kids to un understand the meaning of the new word. And also in the writing tutor, for example, always uh, the little one, he or he maybe don't have, maybe does not like the like the writing homework. So the parents have the headache how to teach the kids to write. So he can get the prompt or inspiration from the AI prompt, and he can give the step by step like the hints to 
kids to follow his like uh, content and think uh, content generation thinking to finish this kind of writing. So this is not a direct answer given to kids. It's kind of uh, inspiration generated to the kids through the AI. So here's a Thinky, and you can interact with my voice. It's like a Siri for the kids, and uh, this avatar is built by us. It's uh, integrated with our chat GPT model, and it can have the verbal communication with the kids. Of course. Uh, there's so much potential if you do this correctly. There's a lot of potential, right? Yeah. But uh, this this is a, like a tablet you're selling. You're selling the whole tablet, including the mirror system here for the front facing camera to go down on the table. And then um, uh, it comes with a keyboard option. Yeah. We so have a full laptop. Yeah, we have like the option for a keyboard. Uh, maybe the like uh, the kids is a heavy writer. He can she or he can buy the like a uh, option with the keyboard. There's a little bit difference on the price side, but the device and functions are, are the same. But we made uh, this kind of two options uh, do you use for the like the customer to choose. So. Of course, it's very important to go to school and have a teacher and have uh, classmates, but it's also great to have uh, a child maybe read the whole library and or want to learn more about something specific. And uh, thanks to AI and these engines, in, in theory, there's no limit. You yeah. can learn as much as you want about yeah. whatever you want. Yeah, we have this kind of proprietary content library for the kids, including like picture book, ebooks, and academic content uh, for the kids. So we update the content from time to time, and also we have like a different grades of like the content for the kids. For example, from four to grade six in primary school, the kids can get onto the difficulty level anytime with uh, like his or her own capability and grow with uh, alongside uh, along with uh, like a kids grows, he can get the content just right for him or her. All right, so I put the finger under the question that I have, and then it's going to basically uh, crop and scan the page and then do a bunch of AI to, to explain the problem, I guess. So here's the think is thinking. Yeah. It depends on the internet connection speed here. Yeah, yeah, right. So we have like the two options. One is like a math calculation. We can recognize the content on table on the like paper, give the correction of the math calculation. And this one is like a snap, snap math, meaning that if you have like the workbook, for example, uh, give this, for example, this one, you can finger point to the problem and. To the tablet can give the instant answer, which is step by step, to the kids to inspire kids to think and to solve the problem him or herself. This is not a direct answer to the kids, and the kids doesn't think about that. This is like the guidance and also like the tutoring with like the uh, step by step explanation to make thing, make people and kids to think him or herself. So you don't give the answer, but you help find the right, answer. Right. We don't just uh, use AI to give the answer. That's useless for the kids. We use AI to uh, be a, like a tutor, a mentor, a motivator for kids to, to better educate it. Can you explain the company, Think Academy? What is Think, the company? Our company is named the Think Academy. We have two decades of uh, history providing learning services, publishing services, smart content, smart hardware, and also digital apps for kids throughout the globe. Well, our headquarters in the US is based in California, in the Bay Area, Cupertino, and we have like an online, offline tutoring business across the, all the states here. And also we are just uh, working hard on this kind of hardware business unit to make the bespoke and customize the hardware uh, kids like and parents can feel safe about in the US market. Current our age group is from uh, three to five and from five to uh, four to 12 in two sectors. One is this kind of uh, like electronic device for the kids driven by AI. Another is like the three to five preschool uh, screen-free tablet with uh, like uh, content uh, from update from time to time. It's another product. So you sell the tablet. There's no chance this little adapter here could just fit any other tablet. And then uh, you just load the software and uh, sell like a platform or something like that? Yeah, that is a good question. Of course, we can 
uh, make an application and we can just uh, uh, use the, any like uh, normal tablet, but we want to build this kind of uh, fusion of uh, software and hardware to integrate better the algorithm and all the AI driven functioning in it. And we can gather the data and also make the smooth list like interaction from time to time. And of course, uh, very importantly, we want to penetrate this tablet to other market like the school market, which can be a integrated solution for different kind of customers. So we think that integrated hardware and software is very important for make like a perfect product. So right here you have the Chinese sentence and it's translating and in English, and ball every time uh, for example. Uh, but what would be nice is that, uh, you know, you take the school uh, curriculum, yeah. the homework, yeah. and you put it in front of the tablet and it just works. Yeah, right. For example, in the learning scenario in school, the teacher can improve his or her like the teaching efficiency, can help the teacher to do this kind of a normal correction and also revision of the materials. So this can be uh, helped by the in-school scenario tablet, which is uh, we haven't uh, penetrated yet, but we are thinking of that. It would be nice that this would be a next level whole UI and not have any icons and it just should be maybe this guy and uh -huh. he has a screen and uh, you just speak with him and he can look at your at your homework and he can help you with your homework and then he can say are you interested in trees I will tell you more about the trees and actually this guy has Wi-Fi yeah this is uh, actually a mascot we are just uh, using in the CS as a gift but this is a very, very good idea that market, uh, market is buying in. So this is like in character our thinking AI avatar, but we are thinking of like a, to make a very good avatar that can kids can really love. Because if I operate on him and I go inside, I see uh, maybe it's just a Bluetooth speaker with a microphone and then everything happens through your phone. You need to load the app to get all the functionality or yeah, right. We just uh, press the button and talk with him. Yeah, oh, right. Sorry. With the internet. Yeah, it's a touch yeah. and speak. What do you say? I mean, you just uh, uh, put, put the button and talk with it. Uh, with, uh, connect with the internet. It's all okay. It connect directly to the internet? Uh, yeah. That's cool. No app, no app needed. Just uh, connect it with the internet and uh, you just uh, press the button and talk with it. <laughs> Whoa, that would be amazing. That's that's my dream. I want to speak with your mascot. Uh -huh. That's a cool mascot. Is I see it as a panda up here, and or oh, is it a panda hat? Yeah. On your mascot. Thinky yeah, it's a panda inside, hat, right? but the character is like the Thinky. The same appears with our like avatar in the uh, tablet. And you partner with uh, OpenAI with Microsoft. Yeah, uh, right. to get the the AI from them in your system, right? Yeah, we work very closely with Microsoft Azure Cloud and to get into the GPT model, which is updated from time to time to get the best like AI model from the market. So we are like in a collaboration to fulfill this kind of function smoothly. So, so smoothly. I'm very excited about the potential. Yeah. The question is how good you make it, right? Yeah. The software needs to be, you know, uh, the kids can figure out all these icons, of course, it's not a problem, but what I'm thinking is, I just want this little thinky guy. Okay. Uh, you know, the thinky, okay. it looks different a little bit than the US okay. version. Yeah. But uh, to have the thinky guy just figure out whatever you want to do, it just figures it out. Yeah, it's not. And maybe you have some, yeah, as you have some plans, but you don't really need to have a plan. Yeah, you know that in our US version, the thinky is just, just like an avatar on top of every user interface and also the function, meaning that in the learning scenario, for example, learning the math or learning the, your, the, the kids are doing reading, I think I can be a teacher or a tutor or motivator in the learning process. But when the kids is doing other like a content or reading a book, I think it can just uh, have a, like a chat with the kids and also remind kids to do the task or do the fun, fun activities every day. And it's kind of a, a friend of the kids in any kind of a scenario and a function. This is the thinky guy. Yeah, right this there. is our like the avatar, the mascot named the Thinky. Yeah, nice. Uh, do you partner with the schools, with the government? In the U.S., at this point, we have not, but we are looking for partners to partner with like the schools and school districts to help them. And also, we will just uh, customize our product to be more fit for the school market, of course.